two bad games. So y'all gotta understand, y'all gotta calculate the game. You two, no matter how old you are, you're so young, you gotta play, play. You need development. Y'all need development. Y'all gotta understand the business side of this. You gotta remember, if he put his name on you, if he puts his name on you, then y'all go over there and sink it up. What do you mean by that? Now he will look at me and say, Coach, I'm sorry. The shots are the shots are everywhere. He was just talking to me about how he loves it, but how much KC does. Now he wants to see KC. Let him pick up those shots. It's not a reason. You're a director. Again, you understand, you can't just get the ball, you go overseas and drop your head and try to run somebody out. That don't work overseas. Them jokers are corn fish. Okay? I gotta understand the game. And then when you two start wrestling with each other, I first it's like awesome coming out of you doing this. And then y'all just start wrestling, y'all stop playing. Y'all spend more time wrestling. He didn't want to see that. He loved you two. He made me phone call. So all that, that's that's what y'all waste time. It's doing the that's for Okay? Little thing. Uh John, you dribble too. Okay. What else can you do besides Chuck? Did you see what the people Ken just said? What did we just say? I was fussing about you two all day. And then, what, what did we do? I, I put y'all in the corner. How many shots you made in a row? You went, you went what, four for six? All you did is stand in the corner and KT just fed you every time. And me and Ken, and he's like, oh. oh. You see how simple that was? You didn't have to run around. You didn't want to have to run around do all that crazy stuff. It's right there. Simple looks good. You know what I'm saying? So y'all think I'm being mean, but I care. Go through this experience. You went through this. I don't understand. You haven't went through it yet. Wait till you go through these, these guys went through it. Jordan went through it. These guys, the guys that go through it, they know how it is when you go to the professional level and how they treat you. You're just an asset. You know, most of the time when you go to an organization or a program, it's just like in college, getting like that in the NBA, most of the time when you go to a combine, they're going to go through the time of showing you what they want you to find. Then they get out in the scrimmage, and if you don't run that, they ain't going to tell you they got, you got to line through your name. You ain't, you ain't do what they ask you to do. And they ain't gonna have a conversation with you. You go to the board, see you, you gonna come back. Yeah, my name ain't on the list. That's how they doing that now, you know what I'm saying? So when we get here in these sessions, and these guys give y'all feedback about what you need to do, I need to follow that, you hear me? Because when you go to a the combine, they gonna tell you what they want you to run, they gonna tell you what you want your role to be. It's gonna be real quick and fast. Did you save that? Now we in the scrimmage. Look at me, you know what I you that's how they get to talking, and then they start, they go through the who we deleting process. <laughs> now they only five names left. You know what I'm saying? Take that to heart, man. Whatever they're telling you to do, do it. And then, once you get comfortable, once you get in there, then you can just do what you do. You hear me? You should have land the job first. Doing what they told you to do. Then when you get in there, you can relax and kind of say, oh, okay, now I can interject my game is you got to do what they ask you to do first. All right? Just remember that. That's what it's changing to. Go and you can learn from it. Right, their, their job is to eliminate you. Right. You got to show you can learn and do what they say. But also, you guys got to show you love it. All right. Someone's like, I was fortunate to work with one of the mad GM coaches all week. And he was getting mad at that. He's like, I die for this shit. Like, he's like, I'm, I'm not gonna let. He said, I would die before. Sorry, my language. He, that, that's what he said. He said, he said, I would die before someone put on me. And you guys, like, you're saying, I got ball, but you're backing up. You don't have ball. So, push yourself more. That Someone should be standing out just by that. You guys, just figure it out. I care about you guys. I love you guys. If I didn't care about you guys, I wouldn't even have you here. I wouldn't even put my name on it. If I didn't care. Even you guys I just met.